right, we're live. Waiting for you to get in. Building. They say that's the worst thing to do because <laughs> no one will ever look at your replays because they just see a guy sitting there Not staring. Like looking, looking yeah. good. <laughs> All right, okay. Welcome to another episode of Scope Talk Live. I'm your host, Chris Stanley, and with me on my panel is Ron and Gail Bennington. Oh, how are you? Thanks for inviting us back. Yeah, it's great to be here. You're very welcome. You know, I saw a couple powerful scopes today. I saw David Steinberg trying to uh, explain Periscope to Gilbert Godfrey <laughs> as if he was a child. It was really, really funny. And then it came up that Gilbert does his own Periscopes. But he was like, Gilbert? You can get hearts on here. Do you know that? You like hearts. I'm David Steinberg, and you can get hearts. It was one of my favorite things I ever saw. And then I saw a cry for help from Jenny Hutt, oh, which God. was she woke up in some bad place. Yeah. She had no makeup on. To drop on Vegas. Yeah, she was just. <laughs> Dear God, help her. Yeah, she said she had been taking some kind of natural Viagra. <laughs> It was sad. And then she just goes, well, that's it for me. And clicks off. It's very sudden. Yeah, I called 911 immediately. <laughs> and said, take away your phone. <laughs> How about you guys? You see any good scopes? Uh, I saw a, I went back to um, Russia uh, last Stop. evening. No, this is bad. <laughs> Stay away. Found another high school class, but this time it was a young boy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want this to happen. Very northeastern Russia. Yeah. Kind of dreary and shitty, to be totally honest. <laughs> you or the periscope? Both. What about you, Gail? Yesterday I saw a, a periscope. I decided to just search on who had the most viewers at oh, the time. That's always a chick. Um, and I clicked it, and it was a girl who could not have been more than 15. Oh. And she's like leaning forward. Her tits are right in the camera, and she's like, okay, guys, I'm going to change. And I was like, no, get it off. What's, what's that I'm username? <laughs> I'm just curious. I'm on a list now, guys. Yeah. I'm on a list. A good list. Though. No, that's no. no good list. Oh. There's no such thing as a good list. We're being watched. Right? Yeah. <laughs> They're scoping you, scoping them. Oh, Jesus, I didn't realize that. Yeah. I feel kind of weird now. So what do you guys think is going to happen in the scope world? There's a big smoking with Chris coming up. Uh, Tomorrow morning, 10:45 a.m. I think I'll be smoking these weird R. Is it what are these? These are RGDs, manufactured <laughs> by Ford China Tobacco U Bell Industries. You're gonna get busted for having that. There you go. There's gonna be a cigarette investigation, and they'll bring you down as a kingpin because they're gonna think you're a dealer, but it's just your own. The bar has been set high this week. Yeah. So I feel like. You're gonna have to step up your game. You're not the big man on campus anymore. Well, guess what? Big man on campus ain't graduated yet. How about that, <laughs> motherfucker? All right? Because fucking, there's big plans open for tomorrow. I mean, I, there's a new setting now. I want to get this straight. Did you just call me motherfucker? I want to <laughs> know before I start swinging wildly if I should. No, 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 no. I wasn't calling. No, of course not. No, 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 no. No, no there is some light nudity in Joey JoJo's. <laughs> Uh, yes, is that there something is. that you're willing to do to get hearts? Oh, uh, sure, yeah, I'll pop a nip out. <laughs> well, he was rolling around shirtless with a Lucas brother, or whoever that is. It's like a, he lives with a Lucas brother standing. That and guy's you know, great, though. Look, look at this lady watching the scope. Turn around there, she just stopped and was weirded out by you. Um, or I guess all of us. I can't just blame it on you. But you know, by the way, uh, for any people who follow Scope Talk, they realize we're in a different studio today. We're normally <laughs> over there, uh, but they're putting up the winter lights. So we don't get the, the Fox News scroll. It's very different. It's easy, for us. yeah. No, I'm not informed about anything today. I don't know what the fuck's going on. That's well, one of the, your big gimmicks in smoking with It's Chris. a segment, not a gimmick, Gail. <laughs> Motherfucker. Hey, motherfucker. Um, but kind of no. no. I was talking to the periscoping audience. <laughs> it's, it's ugly for panelists on this show. <laughs> but I did see up there that Cuba is sending troops into Syria, which this hasn't happened. You know, I mean, we, we make one little deal with them, and now 
They're sending their troops out. What's again. the Cuban military got at this point? What could they actually help with? They got black kids. Oh, okay, yeah. cool. And they're joining Russia. They're not on their own. Oh, that's it. They also have baseball players. That that could be useful somehow. I just stereotype. Oh, they're pretty good though. Yeah, they El Duque, good. baby. Like they're a Warriors game. They're just gonna be baseball bats. So, are, do you have any guests on smoking with Chris, or you're gonna be running around from place to place as fast as you as can? As you always do. Um, I have a tentative guest booked for tomorrow morning, so I'm going to confirm them today. Right. So I'm not going to give anything away. I like that when Chris talks, he puts it <laughs> close up on his mouth. Like, Here's where the sound is coming from. I can't. You've never let once. Any sniper would kill you. <laughs> He's third on a match by himself. Oh, excuse me, I had to. Light my cigarette. Look at our studio audience over there, just looking at us like we're disgusting. Over to the right. Yeah. We're disgusting. With what a bunch of fucking weirdos, huh? I'm talking about those those two ladies, not us. We're on top of our shit. <laughs> no, not our panel. We got it. It's not an attack on our panel. Oh, of course not. No. Yeah, who does it? They got a whole store for one. <laughs> Every product now has its own store. I like that though. If yeah. I need a container, I go to the container store. Right. If I want scrapple, I go to the scrapple mall. <laughs> Ooh, I'd love to join you. Sure. Of course. Oh, look at that shot. That's amazing. Beautiful. Yeah, now try to read the comments sideways. Oh, shit. I didn't even think of that. You never read comments. Let's see. Uh, Gail is perfection. I'm, oh. oh. That is so sweet. That makes me and Chris feel like shit. <laughs> Coolest cats on the street. Jam on, Scrapple. <laughs> Look at the shot he's doing with his face right now. He's not a very conscientious cameraman. Well, <laughs> that was a good shot, right? Yeah. He's like, did you ever see that uh, movie? I was like, Jersey something, Jersey... Girl? No, Jersey State. Jersey... Jersey. New Jersey State. Garden Jer State. Garden State. State, right. That dude, uh, and I've had him on a couple times, and he's a really nice guy. But every, since he directs and stars, there's a lot of close-ups of him. <laughs> and you'd think that if you were the director of something, there would never be a close-up of you. I get that. I get that a lot. Uh, like, I understand where Zach Braff's coming from with that move. Excuse me. You're Zach Griff. <laughs> <laughs> so what are you doing on Smoking with Chris tomorrow here doing scope time? Give us some spoilers. Okay, yeah. uh, there's going to be some new headgear. I'm going to fucking tell you that right now. Really? Right? New headgear, because I, I rocked the bandana twice. I got to mix it up for every now and then. You know? Oh, I thought yeah. you mean like braces. <laughs> <laughs> no, I... fitted for some new headgear. He's getting Man. braces, but on his legs. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if the girls are going to like these braces. <laughs> well, you're getting a sling soon, too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna, I'll be in a sling for a month. Yeah. How will you periscope? I don't know. I'm not it's not your periscope, Barman. I'll be fucking... This will be the periscope. <laughs> hey, how's it going? Smoking with Chris. This is a lot harder than it used to be, but I'm still doing it. Uh, you know, the cigarette will never leave my mouth. The, I talked to his doctor, because he's a surgeon, and he said it was just, a, you know, Chris is at that age now that, you know, after a good 10 years of constant jerking off, the shoulder is going to give out. <laughs> There's no cushion left in my shoulder, <laughs> is what I was told. There's no cushion from all that pushing. Yeah. Ow! On yeah! Your, on your yeah. shelf! Yeah! <laughs> Hot! Stand up. Stand up. You're a funny man. You're a funny man. And this is the kind of stuff you're going to get on Smoke with Chris. Oh, yeah. oh, there's going to be a set change as well. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and I'm going to give away who the guest is for Smoking with Chris. Please don't. Let me just say, it's the opening act for Taylor Swift. Chris nice. met him today in the hall. Great. It just seems like they hit it off. You know, I didn't want to give that away, but yeah, I'm, I'm setting up some, uh, some speakers out here. It's gonna be really good. It's gonna be a live performance. How's the mouth close up? Did that work out for you, Chris? <laughs> How's it going, everyone? Oh. I hope your dentist is following this. <laughs> I hope not. I'll be getting a call. That's uh, that's gonna be Photoshopped, <laughs> I'm gonna tell you right now. <laughs> Find all these cats. Oh, yeah. So, I guess this is it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, so we're not talking about scoping that much. I gave away my two scopes I saw this morning sure. in seconds. Yes. <laughs> I could have just blurred them out. And you know, I, I was a little light on the scoping last night because just, I, I don't know, I gotta get out of Russia. Maybe I'll move a little more west. Maybe I'll move over to mainland Europe. Well, where do you go first? I always, 
I'm New York first, hoping that it's going to be one of our buddies. Yeah. Um, I travel down to Florida sometimes. Me really? Too. Yeah. Miami yeah. or Tampa Bay? Miami. I go to Tampa a and lot. I go to uh, LA. Any LA stuff is great because it's normally Mexicans and black guys smoking weed. <laughs> and the pride they have in their weed. I'm like, it's legal, dude. You're not impressing anyone. Pretty sweet, right? <laughs> A good place to go is like Britain at like around 11 at night because that's when everyone's like up and they're really fucked up yeah. and they're just looking to get even more fucking trash. So you will see a bunch of bros just fucking losing their shit. Yeah. Thanks. That's just, that's a, that's a scope tick. A scope tick. That's a scope tip on Scope Talk Live. By the way, I was watching a Neil Young concert last night and I'm like, that can't be right. Oh my God, we've got a huge star just dropped by the stairs. Turn it around here. Uh, hey, what's going on? <laughs> How we doing? Surely good to see you. We're doing a little scope talk today. No, about all the periscope stuff. That's awesome. Are you a scope? No, I'm just a disheveled Jew. <laughs> that's all I'm doing. What are we gonna do to get you back on our show? It just doesn't seem to happen well, as much wait, as we wait, want. When you want me, I'm there. All right, next what day is open next week? Next Wednesday. All right, boom, it's locked. And it's done. locked. Done. It's just that easy. <laughs> I've been walking around the city for hours waiting for people to book me on shit. Finally paid all It's Scope Talk Live. Yes. All right, looking forward to it. Okay, buddy, see you then. Love you guys. Bye, Shuli. Shuli is an amazing uh, comic and uh, works for the Howard Stern Show. He's one of the real good dudes at SiriusXM and incredibly funny. That's the kind of pop-ins you're going to get. That's what happens on Scope Talk. Scope Talk Live. Yeah. <laughs> As opposed to that, those replays of Scope Talk. <laughs> oh, yeah. How quick before we just start calling it STL? <laughs> right now. That's Dude, we it. should get STL shirts. Oh, oh God, yes. Yeah. I'm going to get those printed up with a big Periscope sign on them. Oh, I was in Tampa and saw a Hooters girl uh, who twerked at work. She was pretty excited. Oh, that's pretty hot. Oh, yeah. I like that. Good. Yeah. It felt like all the fun of Hooters without that food. Right. Was it Hooters sanctioned? I don't, I don't believe so. Okay. I think she was a renegade. Okay. She was just off the reservation this week. I'm going to let Hooters know about that then. <laughs> they should be knowing what their employees well, are remember doing. Remember, you were supposed to get the 50% card that I live with and then you never got one from BL. BL's a liar and she doesn't hook me up with anything. Right. And she just lies and tries to just bum rush the studio at all times. All right, read us some questions and then we got to get go to work. All right. Quick, uh, quick uh, couple questions here on Scope Talk Live. Um, someone says Pepper can't read. Um, Chris, does the saddle ever irritate your back? No, because I don't wear a saddle, okay? You can see that I'm not wearing a saddle. That could be great for uh, smoking with Chris. Maybe a little ride for someone. I doubt that. I doubt that will happen. The ISIS music is starting behind us, so it's difficult to hear. I hope it's okay. Yeah. What's going on? I heard death to the infidels. Will Gail marry me? Marry me, Gail. Hmm. Shave, please. <laughs> hey, look, this is a nice fucking... Uh, it's because of the close-ups. <laughs> Where's my STL shirt? All right, that's enough. Yeah, right. We gotta wrap it up. All right, that's it for Scope Talk Live. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Periscope World. And we'll see you on Bennington at noon on Raw Dog Comedy Hits 99. Can't oh. stop the broadcast.